Hello, Tim here. Welcome back to my channel. Another crazy wood corner today. Today we're going to talk about sumac. And sumac is uh, the bright colored leaves that you see in the fall along the highway. And it's staghorn sumac is quite pretty, but it's a, it can be an invasive species too because it keeps shooting up new sprouts up in uh, from the main branches. It just branches out and keeps going. So you got to uh, make sure you mow them back. Now, I had these uh, this sumac growing in my backyard. And this particular tree got fairly big. This is kind of toward the base. And the interesting thing about this wood, it's not, it's not used for lumbering or anything like that. It, it turns pretty good, but, uh, and, it, and it's pretty good for carving. But the thing I like about this, which is really crazy, it's, it's one of the few woods that fluoresce under black light. And so uh, I turned a little bowl out of sumac and up here's a, a piece of walnut and then uh, a stone that's kind of greenish color that I uh, like a, uh, an agate sort of that I use for a knob. On a previous video I talk about using uh, agates and found objects for uh, accent pieces. So this whole piece here, not a, not a very uh, promising piece but it turned out really really good once I turned it. But this has got a, a, a finish that's uh, shellac and uh, oil rubbed on the lathe. On a previous video I did Christmas tree turnings and I didn't really feature this one here instead it was I believe apple wood that I was turning and uh, I, I showed the process of how I get there but the reason I'm showing this now is this is such a, a, a very pretty piece of wood out of the same tree actually. Let's see what this looks like under black light. Now look at how this, if you can see that, I'll hold it close to the ultraviolet light. It really fluoresces up pretty. Look at the end grain of the piece that I just cut. Looks kind of like a fluorescent agate. And check out the Christmas tree. That's one of the things I like about discovering, and there's a, a few other species. I think uh, uh, honey locust does this too. I, I, I try different woods, but it just is uh, quite stunning, quite remarkable. This may not show up on camera like I'm hoping it will. In person, it's, it's quite remarkable. So that's it for uh, sumac and my crazy wood corner this time. I enjoy finding out what wood does and I hope you do too. Please subscribe and give it a thumbs up and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Color okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what that looks under under <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.